inside of Moho Pro 12. I've been using Moho for about five years now and animating with software like Flash and After Effects for 15, 16, actually it might be 17 years. I've been doing it since high school. Anyway, I haven't really fully explored the 3D elements of Moho until more recently, and I find it to be a cool way to work. Not only can you design 3D sets that are nice and dynamic, you could even design props, texture them out, and rotate them and take pictures of them and use those as 2D assets in your cartoons. So you can use it as a way to speed up your workflow, but also to add a little bit of visual flair to what you're doing. We'll begin this course by sketching out a scene. It's important to understand what you plan to do before you dive in and start building 3D objects. We'll also ready up a Moho document and then draw out some 2D props to prepare them for 3D conversion. We'll then talk about converting vectors to 3D and depth sorting, in addition to setting up your 3D objects, including the floor, your background elements, and of course, the main foreground elements. We'll then move over to creating and applying textures to our objects and laying out the scene further. Then we're going to animate. We'll animate out certain set pieces, including the lava, bubbles, we'll have some steam or smoke shooting out, and then we'll animate our character jumping from rock to rock, interacting with the environment. And then finally, we'll talk about adding some atmosphere, including clouds, blurs, and blend modes. And then we'll export our work out for the world to see. By the time you're done with this course, you should have a strong understanding of how to build 3D sets within Moho and animate your cartoons within them. I hope you're ready, because we're about to get started.